Jesus saith unto him, Rise, take up your bed and walk. John 5, verse 8. Like many others, the impotent man had been waiting for a wonder to be wrought and a sign to be given. Wearily did he wash the pole, but no angel came, or came not for him. Yet thinking it to be his only chance, he waited still, and knew not that there was one near him whose word could heal him in a moment. Many are in the same plight. They are waiting for some singular emotion, remarkable impression, or celestial vision. They wait in vain and watch for naught. Even supposing that, in a few cases, remarkable signs are seen, yet these are rare, and no man has a right to look for them in his own case. No man especially who feels his impotency to avail himself of the moving of the water, even if it came. It is a very sad reflection that tens of thousands are now waiting in the use of means and ordinances and vows and resolutions, and have so waited time out of mind, in vain, utterly in vain. Meanwhile, these poor souls forget the present Savior, who bids them look unto him and be saved. He could heal them at once, but they prefer to wait for an angel and a wonder, to trust him as a sure way to every blessing, and he is worthy of the most implicit confidence but unbelief makes him prefer the cold porches of Bethesda to the warm bosom of his love. Oh, that the Lord may turn his eyes upon the multitudes who are in this case tonight. May he forgive the slights which they put upon his divine power, and call them by that sweet constraining voice to rise from the bed of despair, and in the energy of faith take up their bed and walk. O oh Lord! Hear our prayer for all such at this calm hour of sunset, and ere the day breaks may they look and live. Courteous listener, is there anything in this portion for you?